Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Today we are focused on uh, the life of Zakaria alayhi salatu wassalam. Zakaria, of course, is the name that is mentioned in the Old Testament. He is uh, known for his patronage of Maryam alayhi salatu wassalam. Uh, there are 12 verses in the Quran that uh, refer to Zakaria alayhi salatu wassalam. He is uh, described as a pious, as a competent, as a qualified person in the sense that uh, his expertise and his character was well known to the community and they respected him. He was the one who was in care of uh, Maryam alayhi salatu wasalam, especially at a time when she was going through the most difficult period of her life where she was pregnant and people were pointing fingers at her and that was the time when Zakaria alayhi salatu wasalam, was responsible for, him, for her. One of the interesting things is that the Maryam alayhi salatu wasalam, had dedicated herself to the, uh, you know, to, the, to, to serve the uh, house of God which was in Jerusalem at that particular time. And uh, she was, of course, uh, being uh, uh, victimized by many other priests and it was Zakaria alayhi salatu wasalam, that uh, sheltered her, that uh, protected her, that ensured that no one uh, touches her, no one hurts her. And it was uh, that leadership that was uh, uh, accepted and acknowledged by the Quran uh, that Zakaria alayhi salatu wasalam, showed. Uh, during her pregnancy, he was uh, uh, constantly visiting her and making sure that she stays well. And uh, when uh, uh, you know, he found uh, uh, food and other provisions with her, he was uh, a bit surprised and uh, you know, to reassure that it is coming from God, he asked that and of course he was uh, convinced that it is from God Almighty that he would be, uh, that Maryam wasalam, is blessed. He was also um, blessed with the, his son at the, towards the uh, old age uh, and uh, he was himself not sure if he would have the son, yet the Quran says that uh, one of the signs is that he should keep quiet for uh, you know, by talking about this particular thing for the for three days, and then Allah Subhanahu wa Taala would bless him with the with the son. And of course, Yahya alayhi salatu wasalam, or known as John, uh, uh, was blessed and and, and uh, was given to to Zakaria alayhi salatu wasalam. So he is described as Salihin. He is described as the one who is strong in character. He is described as the one who protects. Uh, Maryam alayhi salatu wasalam, he is the one who is uh, considered to be one of the muttaqeen, very pious and very devoted to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And he is the one who uh, is given a child towards the end, like Ibrahim alayhi salatu wasalam, towards the end of his life to ensure that the message that he has been communicating uh, would continue to be communicated through his son. Ya ya alayhi salatu wa salam aqulu qawli haza wa astaghfirullahi li wa lakum We hope you enjoyed the video please subscribe to our channel